Okay, la, this is the second video of this of this topic of lecture night. So now this you have a question where you have an open valve, two pulley and all those stuff. Huh? Let's write down things that we know of, the value that we know of. Huh? We know that a small little diameter D is hundred. Hundred lah. So I just put in hundred. And the big pulley is uh, 250. And the center distance is uh, 650. So to get ourselves clear, we just have to draw the triangle again so that we appreciate the equation a bit better. Lah. So I'm going to draw a triangle again. Uh, I'm going to draw a triangle here. A 90 degrees triangle. Lah. Just to get the terms correct. Lah. Now there's a 90 degrees over here. I know that the distance here is going to be C. This will be X. And this will be D minus D over 2 and this angle I'm going to call it beta now from here we will define look at the right angle triangle we will be able to say that sine beta I'm going to write over here sine beta will be equal to d over 2c let's put in the values we got 2, 5, 0 subtract 100 divided by 2 times the center distance and that will give me a angle of 0 0.115 radian I already do the inverse sign already yeah? so that is the angle that I have let me move this away yeah? I continue from here now the question, okay, I forgot to ask. See, the question says, uh, find the angle of contact. That means the angle of contact of the small pulley. That is theta S. Uh, I find beta already. And the total belt length, which is L. So let, let's go back to find the theta S. Uh. So we realized just now, we already mentioned that uh, theta s, the equation. Uh. Will be pi subtract 2 beta. And that will be. Zero point one one five, and that will give me two point nine one two radian. Since we need to find the belt length, I know I need to the other angle. Of red. I need to know the other angle too, lah. So angle of red, and this time I will say the bit theta. I mean the uh, theta over L. This will be plus 2 beta and that will be pi plus 2 times and that will give me 3.372 Now x is the distance that we have and we just borrow the equation there x square root of c squared minus over two square putting this value in uh, this is uh, 650 minus this will be 250 subtract 100 and that will give me the belt length of 645 I mean 
you have to be mindful that this uh, this turn, uh, this one, uh, this one, has to be smaller than this lah. Uh. This one, this common sense I tell you, that center distance, so that will be smaller lah. Uh. So the total belt length. Uh, let's put in the equation now, belt length. is equal to the 2x plus half theta small one and the diameter plus half I put the d first of d theta l and let's put in the value now 2 by the x will be 6, 4, 5 just substitute the value of plus half the diameter of this one is uh, 1 100 and the angle is a small one, huh? okay, 2.912 plus half the other time is 250 and the angle is 3.372 and that will allow us to get into the depth length. Okay, I'll stop here for this video.